restrict the purchase capability in a WooCommerce store. In this video, we will discuss how to enable WooCommerce catalog mode on your store to restrict the purchase capability. Before we continue, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and click the notification icon, so you don't miss out on great content related to WordPress and WooCommerce. There are several e-commerce business models where you don't want all store visitors to be able to make a purchase. You may want them to contact you directly, or register on your site. In some cases, you may want to redirect customers to another site to make a purchase. For all these scenarios, enabling catalog mode could help. Let us see how you can manage this easily on your WooCommerce store with the help of a plugin. We will use the Alex WooCommerce Catalog Mode plugin for this demonstration. You can download it from the Alex website or from the WooCommerce plugin repository. Once you install and activate the plugin, you can go to the plugin settings page to configure catalog mode according to your requirements. The first option is to remove the Add to Cart button. You can enable this option and you will see a few more additional options. You can specify whether you want to remove it from the shop page as well as from individual product pages. In addition, you can add a placeholder text to be displayed instead of the button. Save the changes, and the Add to Cart button will be removed from your shop and product pages. The specified placeholder text will be displayed in its place. If you are temporarily not allowing purchase on your store, and are planning to get back soon, this option could be useful. In certain scenarios, you may not want to remove the Add to Cart button, instead change its function and text. The second option of the plugin is to help you with that. Tick the checkbox to enable Customize Add to Cart. Now, you will see further options to specify how you want to apply the changes. You can add custom button text for the product page as well as shop page. You can also change the functionality of the Add to Cart button by redirecting customers to a page of your choice. Enter the URL of the page in the specified field. For example, some wholesale stores may offer bulk discounts and may want to sell only in bulk. Customers can contact them for a quote by specifying their requirements. In that case, you can change the button text to request a quote, and redirect customers to a form where they can enter their quantity requirements. As you can see, the text on the button will change as you have specified. And customers clicking the button will be redirected to the page where they can submit the details for a quote. With the next option, you can hide the price of the product as well. In a bulk purchase, sometimes you may want to provide custom product prices. So, you can hide the fixed price of the product and show a placeholder text. On the plugin settings page, you can simply check the option to hide the price and then enter the text to be displayed. This will hide the price and display the custom text on the store's front end. You will be able to make cart and checkout pages inaccessible to customers by choosing this option. When customers click on the cart and checkout links on the navigation menu, they will be redirected to the home page. You can also remove these pages from the menu if you are maintaining catalog mode for longer periods. Go to menu settings, and remove these pages from your navigation menu. You can exclude site administrators from the catalog mode settings and apply them only to other users. When you enable this option, all users with administrator user role will be excluded from the catalog mode settings. Now, if you want to enable WooCommerce catalog mode only to specific users, you can use the advanced catalog mode for WooCommerce plugin. The setting up is more or less similar to the free plugin we used, except for some additional options. Using this plugin, you can enable WooCommerce catalog mode only for specific user roles. For example, you can customize the Add to Cart button only for unregistered or guest users on your site. Under the role-based settings, you can select the user role and then specify the text in the redirect URL. Now, guest users accessing the page will see the custom button text and will be redirected to the page you have specified for registration when they click the button. Apart from enabling catalog mode for specific user roles, this plugin has a few additional options. 
you can remove the place order button on the checkout page for specific user roles and add a placeholder text. It will also help you hide specific payment gateways for individual user roles separately. We hope this video has helped you understand how to enable WooCommerce catalog mode. You can use the catalog mode option according to your specific store needs. If you want additional features like offering individual product pricing for specific user roles, you can try plugins like LX WooCommerce catalog mode, wholesale, and role-based pricing. Links to all plugins are in the description. Check out LearnWoo.com for more articles, videos and resources related to WordPress and WooCommerce. Also, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, and follow us on our social media channels. Do let us know in the comments section if you want us to cover a specific topic, or if you have any ideas or suggestions.